American pop royalty will appear before the Queen and a worldwide audience of millions. Paul McCartney, Elton John, Stevie Wonder and Kylie Minogue top the bill. Award-winning singer Jeffrey Gurumulunapingu will perform a, spot, a song specially commissioned for the Diamond Jubilee. The concert follows a spectacular pageant on the River Thames, attended by a million people. Europe correspondent Philip Williams reports. Grey skies are winter cold, but no matter, the boats were mustered, the Queen in place on the Royal Barge. Let the pageant begin, the bells pealing a royal welcome. It was led by the human-powered craft, including the Australian lifesavers, rowing and paddling. The rhythms of the oars driven by the various music barges. Some with an unusual blend. Then the magnificent royal barge with its special cargo. The Queen supported by her close family. At every bend, on every bridge, the cheers erupted spontaneously. Well, take it all in. You may never see anything like this in your lifetime again. An extraordinary tribute to a woman who's devoted 60 years of service to the same job and shows no sign of retiring. So many braved the wet and cold, yet no one seemed to care, all with a sense of ownership of this one 86-year-old lady. This is absolutely so wonderful. I've never been felt anything like it before. It's, I feel such an honour and a privilege to be an Englishman here today. It's just total euphoria, really, and it's wonderful to see it all. Uh, does it give you a sense of, of pride in being British? Or is it... Yes, it does. It gives us all identity and we're all proud to be British and we've all come in one. This couple came all the way from the Gold Coast, complete with their own ladders for a clear view. We came for the wedding last year and we thought we wouldn't miss the Jubilee this year. So you got an opportunity. Oh, the, the history of it's fantastic. Back on the river, the Queen's face lit up. On the top of a nearby theatre, a horse of kinds, giving its salute to a delighted equine-obsessed monarch. <laughs> Behind the royal barge, hundreds more boats, including the little ships that rescued so many from the beaches on Dunkirk. History was again being made on the river that has seen so much. It was a day to remember for the Queen and her family, for the countless thousands who lined the Thames, for the soaking rain that couldn't douse the music or the mood of a nation, determined to celebrate six decades of service. Philip Williams, ABC News.